One difference between uh, independent uh, sample ANOVA and repeated Mayer ANOVA is that we have done the assumption that we had independent sample mein karte the, uh, that was uh, homogeneity of the variance. We had said that if we have two groups, then in groups mein jo hai, wo equal groups the variability is equal to homogeneous. Honi yani groups are already different. Na ho. लेकिन चूंकि हमारी रिपीटेड मेयर में तो वो लोग ही वही होते हैं इसलिए इसके तो अजम्पशन की तो की नहीं बनती क्योंकि वी आर नॉट एज्यूमिंग दे आर द सेम पीपल इन लेवल 1 एंड द सेम पीपल इन द लेवल 2 सो यहां पे हमारी रिपीटेड मेयर में अजम्पशन हो जाती है अजम्पशन ऑफ स्पेरिसिटी इट इज मोर और लेस सिमिलर टू अजम्पशन ऑफ होमोजेनिटी ऑफ द वेरिएंस लेकिन यहां पे हम ये कहते हैं कि जो वेरिएबिलिटी है ऑफ द डिफरेंस बिटवीन each pair equal honi chahiye yani ab hum ye nahi kehte ke dono columns mein yani group 1 aur group 2 ke andar variance homogeneous ho balki hum ye kehte hain ke ek individual ka jo pair bana hua hai wo dusre individual ke sath uski homogeneity ya variance ka variability ko homogeneous hona zaruri hai so sphericity sphericity is about assuming that the relationship between scores and pairs of treatment condition is similar so pairs of treatment condition हम compare करते हैं rather than treatment condition itself. Uh, so the pairs of treatment condition is similar that is the level of independence between means is roughly equal. The assumption of sphericity is denoted by E and sometimes referred to as a circularity. It holds true when both the variances across conditions are equal. This is the same as the homogeneity of variance uh, assumption in the between group ya fir independent group uh, ANOVA ke andar jo the. And the covariances between pairs of conditions are equal. Aur iske liye jo hum, pehle humne jo test use karte the, wo Levin's test use karte the for homogeneity of variance ke liye, yahaan pe hum for uh, uh, sphericity ke assumption ke liye hum Mochley test use karte hain. Mochley test assesses the sphericity. If Mochley test statistic is non-significant, this is also the same thing. Just as Levin's test ki value says that it should be greater than 0.05, it should be non-significant to meet the assumption. So, Ferocity is also the same thing. Mochley's test ki value says that it should be non-significant, or value should be uh, greater than 0.05. If test statistic is significant, yani agar wo 0 0.05 se choti aajai, it implies that there are significant differences between the variances in each pair. So, sphericity assumption hamari meet nahi hoti. Lekin jaisa ki maine aapko bataya ki ANOVA is a very robust test. So, iske andar phir ye hota hai ki agar hamari sphericity ki assumption meet na ho, to phir hum greenhouse geyser ki value report karte hain, which I will show you in a minute when we will run repeated Mayer ANOVA. It will give us the table and we will see that if our assumption meet not meeting, then we will leave one value and leave the other values. Ki report karenge. Uh, in large samples, a significant Mochley test could mean a small departure from the sphericity that we have a lot of power to detect. I have told that our sample size has an effect. That's why in large samples, the uh, Mochley ki test ki value is significant. Although we want that it is not significant, na ho, so, we consider the departure from sphericity, but if the sample size is more, still you can report that, even if the value is not. And safer side, you can report the greenhouse geyser ki value. Report kar sakte In small samples, the non-significant Mosley test could mean a large departure from sphericity that we didn't have the power to detect. So, small sample, ke andar, agar aapki Mosley test ki value uh, non-significant, so, uh, if it is significant, it means that you are hugely departing from the assumption of the sphericity. So, for that, you have other alternative options. Hoti hai. A lack of sphericity also causes some uh, amusing uh, complications from past post hoc tests. Uh, bottom line is that sphericity creates a loss of power and an F statistic that doesn't have the distribution that it is supposed to have uh, isko hum karke dekhte hain maybe taaki aapko zyada usme hum explain kar sake by running the um, uh, repeated mayer anova and interpreting the values in the next uh, module